They're driven by 850 horsepower engines and reach speeds of 140 miles per hour. With a power to weight ratio comparable to a Formula One racer, sprint cars are brutally powerful, which can also make them brutally dangerous. The Williams Grove Speedway. A pace car leads 10 sprint cars around the quarter mile dirt track. As the race starts, the cars come tearing around the corner. The cameraman is about to get the shot of a lifetime, if he survives. Sprint cars tear up the track at the Williams Grove Speedway. These racers are both light and powerful, enabling them to hit speeds of up to 140 miles per hour. It's the start of a race. The pace car and 10 racers circle past the cameraman. When the race starts, the vehicles come blazing around the track. Scott Zellers, in car 21, prepares to pass car 88. Zellers clips the rear of car 88, goes airborne, and barrels directly into the cameraman. Zellers' car cartwheels off the track, spewing debris as it goes by. The 1,200-pound racer crashes through a metal fence and finally comes to a stop in a yard 800 feet from the track. Emergency crews rush to the scene. Zellers is still inside the steel roll cage. Seconds later, he walks away from the 120-mile-per-hour crash. Zellers suffers no serious injuries, but his sprint car is a $50,000 loss. As for the cameraman, As the sprint car flies past him, he's hit in the head and knocked unconscious by one of its tires. Amazingly, his injuries are minor and he's back at the track one week later. 